I have noticed, I'm going to go look at that again, but I never thought nothing about it on Scrap Kingdom. Uh, he, look at all this crap. Disregard the transformer question. I want to rest. What's that? Christina. Oh, why? Okay, and I have to send disregard the question on the Transformers. Uh, Scrap Kingdom. And that's where I was going anyway. Oh, uh, he. Is this a new one? Must That's be. quite a little selection. At first I thought it was a Barbie. Must be. Oh, it's just a couple baby chairs and... That he? Back in the wheeler and... Oh, get that know, shot back. Now he'll get that metal hot huh? chair. Me, I'd yeah, be trying well, to resell that stuff, but I'm out of that business now. I'm not going to do it. Does this make a good stand? And, uh... But I, I, somebody said he doesn't use any intros on his videos, and everybody else seems like are using intros. He's using none, and he has like 2,600 subscribers. Not so much. He's not even going to see if that thing works. Me, I, I like to resell stuff, you know, if it's it's got a higher value than scrap value. But he just chunked it in there. I'd almost bet you it works. There goes the fertilizer spreader beyond. Uh, he? Put a bulk item. He's a big man. It's hard to tell how big he is with that shirt on. They're going to lose, look like about a 3X or a 4X shirt. <laughs> We're getting a butt view there, Scrap Kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He got it down, whatever he was doing. There he goes again. Yeah, I don't understand some of these scrappers. Seem like they'd want to get all the value they are. Maybe they just don't want to be bothered with it, you know? It's a lot harder than it looks. And, uh, but I'm assuming he does tons a week. I don't, I couldn't say whether it's one ton or five tons, but some months he has 25 tons or more. Uh, and he talks like that's not a really good month, but he's in the tonnage. And I really don't see how he even comes close to that using that pickup because his, his big his big truck That's a little better. His big truck is down. And uh, I'll tell you right now, as uh, I was into it heavy with two trucks. I bought back in eighty eight U Haul was getting changing over from Ford yeah. trucks to Chevrolet's and GMC's and they were selling all their Ford trucks and I bought 
two of them That's a good day. Ford U-Haul trucks that, that was a 24-foot box with the four-foot overhang over the cab, which made it 28 foot, actually. And I bought two of them and paid 13000 for both of them. They were, they were, I think they were six five, six thousand five hundred each. And um, in my, in hindsight, I would have never bought a U-Haul truck. So they got so much after, aftermarket crap on them things like those governors and stuff that you can't hardly get anybody to work on them. They get up so fast. And it's a pain in the ass just to get parts for that stuff. It ain't like you go to auto parts to get it because they, they, they don't right have the parts for that. You can't go to Ford and get it because it's aftermarket stuff that's on it. But um, it's, a, it's an expensive uh, deal to maintain trucks like that. I mean, you don't, you don't get, if you have to put another set of tires on one, you don't get by for three or four hundred dollars. Uh, you're, you're up there uh, at least probably, I don't know, nowadays probably $200 a tire plus the labor. So it's an expensive deal. And then the tags, you know, he, uh, I forget how much Scrap King said he has to pay for those tags on them big trucks, but it's up there and it's not cheap. And you can get the cheaper rate. But the cheaper your rate is, the less weight you're licensed to carry on that truck. And if you get caught, like if your truck could haul uh, 15,000 pounds and you, your, your license fee is only for 5,000 pounds and you get caught hauling 15,000 pounds, you're going to get fined big time. So that's the way that works. So you best know about what you're going to be hauling in weight. I could get the cheaper tags when I first got them trucks because I wasn't hauling nothing but furniture and foam rubber. But when I went to the junk, that was a lot Well, it sort of turns out to be a uh, barrier or wall. That's been a while. 88, 89. <coughs> 90. Onward. I don't think that's the best. It could actually get me pulled over. I drink too many of these damn drinks. Yeah, when you're making these. You know what, folks? I need this. I'm See, pitching a, like an ad for these people. Not really, but I just want you to know that this Hewlett Packard HP Instant Ink, that's the best damn deal on ink for your printer I have ever seen. I pay $5.98 a month, and I think I'm on the 100 page per month uh, deal. If I go over 100, I, then I have to pay a little extra. But I ain't never went over, and I've always got pages rolling over to the next month. I just got uh, this thing yesterday. My color cartridge is getting low, and they sent them in little boxes like this. And uh, they, you know, this comes. Does that come UPS? Or? No, that's the U.S. Post. Yeah, because they have a wireless wireless printer that can go on, no place to make hook up to the internet. Because uh, uh, to to the they, cause they re to every day you print something, they update. They actually check your computer to see what you printed, and they can tell how much ink you got. And uh, when to send more. Sometimes, one time I got a black cartridge and a color cartridge 
at one clip. This time, this is the coast cartridge. Now that that those cartridges, they're thirty something dollars a piece. Chair, all aluminum, man. Uh, he's got a aluminum chair there. And there's some kind of like a Is that a damn mold or a tiller? Son of a gun. Boy, I could use that. I wonder if he's going to scrap that without checking it. It's a tripod. It's a gun. Look at that tripod. Cool. What are you going to do with that scrap? Watch him throw that down. I bet he's going to scrap that to her. I hope not. At least check it. The thing about my channel is you get to try, I get to try all the different kinds of I don't like the way he scraps truck is set up. It's, uh, of course I told him if that was me I'd have me a wire cage on there and he said something about stuff coming through the bars and stuff but they got this mesh steel that you put on the inside to keep any small stuff from coming out and the way he's got this piece across the uh, top there it hinders you on doing it. I, he needs a better setup. I'm just I'm just mouthing scrap. I ain't crit criticizing. It's not criticizing. I'm just, that's just my thoughts, man. Oh, uh, I'm curious what he's going to do with that, uh, that tiller. I hope to hell he ain't going to crap that. This, oh God, yeah, he's, I bet he scraps it. I'll bet he scraps it. Never needed one of these. Never I take them one. heaters like that apart. I used to all the time. There's good pieces of aluminum in there and a little electric motor, but they're not price of scrap anymore. They're just not cost effective. Um, and lastly, the tripod. Let me come in here. Uh, so such a nice guy. Scrap. And uh, the guy down the street there. Oh. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. It's an old warehouse. And uh, yeah. You just gotta make the scrap when I get it. So. Check out that little tiller before you go and scrap it. If I was close by and if it runs, I would give you a $50 bill. I would give you a $50. I got my bill. I'll get in a hurry. Anyway. And folks, see this damn thing here that pops up? It's from N E N dot S A V E F R O M dot net. That's 
sends all these stupid ads up constantly and I can't figure out how to get rid of it. It's, it's got in on something I've downloaded. Um, I, I don't know what it is, but it's all kind of stupid stuff. And then there's women's pictures pops up there with boobs as big as damn uh, wash tubs, which is, to me is disgusting. Uh, not booze, but something like that. You know, it's they're phony as hell anyway. But I just get sick of this okay. stuff popping up, and I can't get rid of them. All I can do is X them out. But something will be back up again. Let's get back to Scrap Canyon. What's he doing? All right, I missed something. Oh, it's just about. Let me back up here. I don't want to miss nothing. I like Scrap Kingdom. I wish he could get monetized. He, I don't know what the problem is with him getting monetized. He said they make it too complicated. <laughs> he must be online because he just said, Scrap, I hope you're going to check out that little tiller before you go and scrap it. If I was cut, he liked it. He liked that. I'll bet he scrapped it. If I was a betting man right now, I'd bet you ten bucks that he, he's scrapping it. Cause some scrappers, they just think their mind is one track, and that's, that's scrap shred. It ain't reselling nothing or anything like that. A repurpose this scrap. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Now, I know a fella, another fella used to be like that 100%, but over the last few months he's changed. And he he is doing things a little different. I, and anybody knows me and the people I watch, they know who I'm talking about, and I love the guy. All right, man. Yeah. But he, Scrap Team has no intro on his videos and no outro. He doesn't ask you to subscribe. Uh, is that his house? No. What's he getting there? All right, dude. I just did that for you guys to see. What we got, man? Yeah. Like, was fit, was fit back here or do I need to come back? No. Oh, what is it? I wish I was able to get out, you know, had a truck and was able to get out and do stuff and without being so feeble. Stay here or go back? Okay. All right. Okay. All right, what you getting, buddy? Oh, uh, just a bunch of shit. Let's make a video. Let's see what we got for scrap, dude. No, we don't know. Okay. Dude, uh, it out of me. Well, he didn't video it. He changed his mind. Oh, yeah. Changed his mind? What do you mean? I guess that happens to a uh, trinket goblin a lot. Am I good? What happened here? Is that good? Stay here or go back? Okay. All right. Uh, just a bunch of shit. Let's make a video. Let's see what we got for scrap, dude. No, we don't know Okay. Dude, I uh, opted out of the video. He, my, he changed his mind. You lost a deal? I guess that happens to a uh, trinket goblin a lot. 
like, why are you always showing the ground? He's like, well, a lot of people don't want to... A lot of people don't want to be on the video, or... Well, shit. So you do run into that a few times. You don't run into that all the time, but... They don't want to be on the video. That's the, that's where. To put the video away. Well, I guess it's back to the compound. These videos are supposed to be borrowed, right? about finding scrap, not being yapping all the time. Anyhow, that is a little bit of conversation with the scrap kingdom guy. Wow, what the hell is that? I still got something up. Yep, sure did. I'm going to chill out. Okay, that's going to be it, folks, for this. I think I'll post this video. I've been making some like this, but I haven't um, put any up, but I'm going I'm to post this one.